The topic of today's discussion is digital video recorders and the short form of digital video recorder is DVR. So let us start our discussion about the digital video recorders in detail. The technology behind the digital video recorder is that uh, this DVR are the consumer electronic devices that are able to record your video in a digital format to storage devices such as disk drives, USB flash drives, SD memory cards or other local or network mass storage devices. So the technology behind the DVR is rather simple. It is a hard drive driven by the customized operating system. In the case of TIVO, for example, its machines run on a highly modified Linux installation that resides on the hard disk so if you see here how the digital video recorders can be used uh, for your local area network to your personal computer with browsers or, or the client software so here analog cameras are connected with the digital video recorders which records all the contents in the digital form so it will have the analog to digital converter and it will have a storage on which your digital data will be stored and then it will be given to the local area network through network switches it will be given to the personal computers now we'll see how this dvrs will be used to record the live television so first the antenna cable provider first the antenna or the cable provider or the satellite cable is connected directly to the dvrs so as to allow the dvrs built-in tuner access the television signal so your dvr will have an inbuilt tuner to access your analog television so if the signal comes in an analog then it goes into the mpeg 2 encoder which converts it into the digital so from there the signal is sent to two different places the first place is that it goes to the hard drive for storage and the second place is that it goes to the mpeg 2 decoder which converts the signal back to analog and sends it to the television to be viewed so if you see the block diagram whereas you can see this is the control unit the pair ir receiver display uh, panels and control panels are connected but we are not interested here we are interested that your video and audio is given to the video decoder if it is in the analog form it will be converted into the digital and then it is given to the mpeg2 encoder it will be stored on the ASIC and if, whenever it will be required it will be decoded with the mpeg2 decoder and you will get here audio and audio output this is the digital audio amplifier so this is how your dvr internal block diagram is there then the DVR marks a vast improvement in the way the consumer records the television. A major improvement the DVR has over a VCR or DVD recorder is that it is a tapeless. Television is recorded directly on the hard drive, so no additional expenses are required like purchasing blank media such as tapes or DVDs. You can see here your analog cameras and like will be connected to the video record decoders and then it is given to the DVRs which is on SOC that is system on chip and then the data will be given to other uh, blocks. Uh, so I, here we can see the digital video recorders has a live television before that is constantly recording the channel that the television is on. Generally, the DVR will keep about an hour of the past programming on that channel. So for example, if the television was on a channel and you begin watching 20 minutes into a movie, movie, you could rewind the movie to the beginning to watch the whole film. The caveat to this is that the buffer is emptied every time you change the channel. So you would not be able to rewind the movie if you were not already on the channel. So pausing live television is not actually occurring when the DVR is unpaused. The recorded program in the buffer is what is being. View. So this is all about the video recorder. So we'll stop here. Thank you.